Hi guys, so today I'm with uh, Karen and uh, she's been with uh, eTrading Academy for the past uh, seven months and she's been an active part of our uh, Platinum membership. So I always like to start by asking a little bit about uh, your background and your previous experience with trading, if any, and, uh, and if not, what gave you the motivations to learn about trading? Hi, Olivier. So um, I, I'm based uh, in Miami, Florida, and my background is that I have about uh, 19 years of um, experience within the corporate world. Um, I was working in Europe and in the Middle East, so you could say that I had my fair share of traveling around the world. Um, and typically, you know, the nine to five office uh, setting was what I worked at, but with business traveling involved and um, having the commute of, you know, back and forth to the office mm -hmm. at least an hour each way, I was definitely spending a lot of my time away from home. And um, combined with the fact that I have a 12 year old uh, daughter, you know, I started missing a lot of her life and I realized that I should maybe think about different options. So um, around that time, um, everything sort of worked out with uh, my department. Um, I had a boss from hell and that really was, you know, the, the turning point in my career. So I started looking for other jobs and then um, I thought about what is, it that I'm, what is it that I'm good at doing? And uh, I enjoy dealing within the markets and that side of the business. So adding everything up, I started thinking, you know, what, what, what I really want to do and how can I combine what I'm good at and my experience? So um, I started looking around and I found, about, I found out about the E-Trading Academy. Um, and I started conducting my own due diligence about it. Uh, I like the way that, you know, your course was structured. I like the fact that you had uh, relevant experience from the markets, um, a good reputation. So very quickly, I signed up for the three-month membership. That was sort of a test service, and I absolutely loved it. So after those three months, I continued on to the remaining 12-month membership, and uh, I was hooked. And I really enjoyed it so far. It's been an absolute dream come true. I have the freedom that I want, and um, I think I'm going to be doing this for a long, for for the long term. You know, for the long haul. Okay, it's interesting to see that uh, you've you've reached your dream uh, land and uh, you know the land of opportunities. Um, I'm glad to enjoy that, that you you enjoy your new venture and. Um, and you know, like many of us get caught in the nine to five routine. Uh, I mean, like we get out of college, we get student loans to take care of, then, you know, we, we need to start making money SAP and then we get married, build a family, get a mortgage, blah, 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 and the whole shebang, you know, and uh, with all that lineup, we we never really feel that we, we've had a chance to take a risk and start our own business, which really is what like uh, proprietary trading or trading like we do from home uh, or anywhere is. So um, I know that you know, I don't like to generalize, but you know, because obviously you find entrepreneurs, startups and, and the like, but these people are, I think, the minority, I believe. And uh, when we're self-employed and on the one hand, it's a bit scary that, uh, you know, on the other hand, it's super exciting because we know that every day we are our own boss, we're depending on our own abilities and uh, to become successful and we still get uh, to manage our time the way that we want so obviously in your case now uh, you get to spend time with your daughter and that's something that's already a big plus for you and, and part of your plan um, so that's great you know now uh, I wanted to ask you since you started the program what's been the most valuable thing that you've learned or, or the thing that you know you like the most about the course so far? Uh, that's a hard question. There's a lot of things I have to say. Um, but I think that um, I like the course videos and I enjoy the live sessions very much. And the amazing thing is that you can get feedback constantly. So if I have you know, a question, it gets answered right away. And at the end of the day, it's, it's this personalized approach so that I don't really feel that I'm out there on my own. And that in itself is, is really um, a very big plus um, and, the, you know, the thing is with trading, it has so many facets. I mean, you have the technical side, which is really important, but that's only one piece of the puzzle. And there's also the psychological aspect, which is very crucial. So having the support and mentoring from such an experienced trader is a very valuable um, asset. 
Um, so, you know, being just able to pick your brain, to run things by you, to understand how you think about things, to get your input, um, how you would handle certain situations, um, that kind of thing gives me the confidence to actually make, you know, the, the trades on my own and, um, you know, I could have maybe handed it on, handled it on my own, but, um, you know, this part of the course is very super valuable and very helpful and gives me the confidence as well. Um, with regards to what I've learned, I've discovered a bunch of great tricks about, uh, you know, for trading, and I feel that the emphasis on risk control is cap uh, is capital, and um, as well as the discipline um, about that. Okay. Well, I mean, you know that uh, we we really wanted to make sure that not only the course would be practical in in all aspects as opposed to big general theories, but. Uh, being able to put in practice so that everyone sees and understand firsthand and soon be able to replicate. So um, the live sessions part of the course is very, very important to the success of our students. And as you've noticed, we also spend a lot of time trying to emphasize the importance on, on the risk management, because at the end of the day, that's probably the one single thing that uh, you can control as opposed to yeah. say the market, which you can't. So if you know that the bit you can control can help your trading, your psychology, then and it makes your equity curve go up nicely without many deep drawdowns, then that has to be your main concern and, off, and, and focus on in your trading apparel. Now, uh, let me ask you, among the, the three main strategies that we teach, uh, what's the one that you feel closer to or more comfortable with so far? Well, the opening session still feels very fast to me, but um, but I've had some decent experience with it. Though um, I must say, at this stage, I'm more of a back to trend player, I think, and I like the slower motion of this strategy. And I also quite like the major reversal warning strategy, which is even a slower motion, as you know. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> like, uh, yeah. Like I often say, you know, I like to push my students to find their uh, bread and butter. So the strategy that they feel comfortable and I ask them to work on it for a while, I ask them to learn to master it and then only then start trying to master different patterns. So if you feel that you prefer the slower pace trading action, then you know, and that suits your personality and style better, then just keep, just keep at it and focus on it right now because you know, that's better to be great at one thing than be jack of all trades and master of none, as we say. So, um, Karen, let me ask you, what, can, what do you find is the hardest aspect in your training at this stage? Um, I think that I still find myself hesitating to um, pull the trigger sometimes. So I have, you know, like I, I have my plan ready and all, but when push comes to shove and it's crunch time, I sometimes second guess myself and it makes me miss some opportunities. So I think, you know, if I had to identify that one thing, that's my greatest challenge. Right. Well, I mean, you don't have to worry because, you know, it is a very common thing among beginner traders. With time and experience, you learn to detach yourself emotionally from, uh, from the trade and treat it like a, it's one among many others. And at this stage, you might be focusing too much on the single outcome and perhaps the fear of loss. Um, but when you start thinking in terms of probable outcomes instead of concentrating on one trade, then that's when you'll be able to become almost like a trading machine. And you'll recognize the pattern. You'll, you know, with the proper personalized risk and money management, you won't second guess yourself anymore. Um, but getting to that point will take time. Yeah. Like I often say, trading and investing is not a sprint, it's a real marathon and you know, one bit at a time. So one trade after one trade, singles, that's what I'd like to basically cash in singles. Um, and now that you'll build your experience, your confidence and eventually your equity. So, you know, you have to be patient and because eventually you'll get there. Um, now to finish up, I'd like to ask you, what is it, uh, what would you say to someone looking for trading education? A course like e-trading. What would be your advice as to, you know, what they should look into? What's important in a course? Sure. Uh, well, I mean, personally, for me, the the approach of this, uh, you know, this personalized approach is very um, is very important because that's you know that's the critical difference between having to study on your own 
and watching DVDs and figuring out everything on your own and by yourself and not really having you know, the person um, there to ask or to consult with. Um, so I would say to look for a good structured course with good support from the teaching team. And uh, most of all, you know, most important of all is to find a team of traders with the relevant experience because it's their experience that's really going to make the difference into making you as professional as possible as opposed to staying, you know, just, just an amateur. And um, another piece of advice I would say is to not be afraid to try things out. You know, sometimes you're not sure at first and you might feel it's a big financial commitment to get the proper education. So, you know, give yourself a try, maybe, you know, three months, six months, and then review it because otherwise you end up just, you know, doing nothing about it and you get blinded in your own daily routine, as you've said, and, um, you know, you're not moving forward at all. So. We're creatures of habits, and it's important sometimes to step up to the plate and, uh, you know, change the status quo and just move forward. Great. Great. Look, um, I, I really want to thank you for taking the time to share your experience. And, you know, and I'm sure that uh, everyone, you know, the, our community of traders always enjoy sharing thoughts of, of the other traders. So, I really uh, want to thank you again and uh, wish you a good continuation in your trading and uh, we'll uh, see you around very, very soon in, uh, in our live webinars. Thank you. Thank you, Karen. <laughs> Take care. <laughs>